Datuk Sri Najib Tun Razak said he understood and acknowledged the call made by voters at the 13th general election for the government to be transparent, accountable and fair in distributing economic benefits. The Prime Minister said that in charting a course towards sustainable economic growth, he would work to ensure that no one is left behind in sharing the fruits of the country's national successes. I wonder if that is any indication that the markets prefer our economic agenda over the opposition's. It was tempting to see the rally as an endorsement of the path we have chosen for Malaysia. But it was also an expression of relief after a year of growing uncertainty, political risks had eased. Najib said this in his keynote speech at the 9th Invest Malaysia Conference in Kuala Lumpur on Thursday. He was addressing an audience that includes foreign investors at the annual event organised by Busa Malaysia. Najib pointed out that market confidence in the government remained strong despite the outcome of the keenly contested 13th general election. This could be seen in the biggest one-day gain recorded by the KL Composite Index, which surged by more than 100 points after polling day on the 5th of May. I understand and acknowledge the message from voters that as we proceed along this path, we must be transparent and accountable and the benefits of economic transformation must flow to all Malaysians. I will work to ensure our national success leave no one behind. The Prime Minister said that after its success in securing a new five-year term, the government now had an opportunity to set Malaysia on a sustained growth path for decades to come. As we approach developed nation status, it is time to reflect, to ask ourselves, where next? The conversation is less about one economic indicator, but more about how we can build sustainable economic growth, about where we should position ourselves in Asia and a global economy, and how we should respond to the geopolitical rebalancing.